Hi everybody, this is Millie. Welcome to Millie's Meal Planning on a Budget. Today happens to be Halloween, so I decided to make something simple. I'm making chili. So my chili consists of Jimmy Dean sausage and rotisserie chicken. So I would like to share with you my chili recipe. So the first thing I do is here I have my pan. So I put one tablespoon of olive oil and now I'm going to add the onion. So I chopped half an onion. Three small cloves of garlic. And now I'm going to add half of a red bell pepper. Two small carrots. Two celery stalks. So I chopped the celery stalks very small. And now I'm going to add half of a green bell pepper. One jalapeno pepper. So I have all the peppers and the celery and the carrots and the onions. I would like to add one teaspoon of salt. So one teaspoon of salt. Half a teaspoon of black pepper. About a quarter teaspoon of paprika. So I added a little bit of cayenne. Now I'm going to add a little bit of garlic powder. Not much because it already has uh, three cloves of garlic there. And then I'm also going to add about a quarter teaspoon of oregano. A sprinkle of onion salt. So now I'm going to mix it all together. And the smell of the onions and the peppers, it's amazing. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a small can of this Rotel tomatoes and peppers. Um, this is very flavorful, so I'm going to add it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to clean pretty much the can with a little bit of water. So I'm going to also add one cup of my chicken broth and half a beer. So this is going to give it some amazing flavor. So I add a half and the other half is for the cook. Now I'm going to add a small can of tomato sauce. So this is going to give it that chili color that we need. Um, and I always like to rinse the, uh, the can a little bit. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of more water. I think that's about half a cup of water. I like to use this tomato paste, the one you squeeze, because it's easier to store in the refrigerator instead of using a can. Also gonna add about one teaspoon of taco seasoning. I like to add the taco seasoning just before I add the beans. And these are the beans I made. So I'm going to, I'm not gonna drain the juice. I know that this consists just of water and, uh, and my chicken broth. So I'm going to add the whole thing there. And that's the reason why I don't cook my beans all the way because since I'm gonna cook them in different things, I don't want my beans to be overcooked. And now I'm going to add, uh, I also pre-cook the Jimmy Dean sausage, not too much. I just wanna make sure that it's a little bit pre-cooked because this is rotisserie chicken and the rotisserie chicken is already cooked. And I'm also gonna add about a cup of corn and this is frozen corn. So I defrosted it and now I'm going to add the corn. So it has the sausage, it has the corn, it has the beans I baked. 
the fresh beans. So now because he has all those spices with the chili peppers and all the other peppers I added, I would like to balance that off a little bit with a little bit of agave instead of adding sugar. A lot of times people add sugar to balance the flavors, but I like the idea of putting a little bit of agave. I'm going to cover it to let all those flavors marry. This smells amazing. Okay, so I cooked the chili for 45 minutes covered and then I uncovered it and cooked it for another 10 to 15 minutes because I wanted the juices to dry out a little bit. So now let's taste it. I tell you, the chili, the chicken, the bean, Jimmy Dean sausage gives it a different flavor. Gives it that chili flavor that you're looking for. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a little bit of Colby Jack cheese, a little bit of sour cream, a little bit of chopped tomato, some avocado. You could add anything you want to this. You know what? I think I will add a little bit more sour cream. Mm, mm-hmm. This is delicious. Make it for your family. Whether it's a football game, the World Series, or just because you want to have chili. Your family is going to love it. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.